Hello, Keith. How are you doing there, Keith? Always ready. Happy New Year. Kendall Hill. Hey, hey, Kendall Hill. Keith, Keith oh, misses me. You miss me, Keith. What? Keith misses me. Oh, Kendall Hill with the 100 biddies. Thank you for those biddies. You're my brother. Heck yeah, Keith. I gotta reset my tablet. Always ready, coming in with Herbert. You know, if you get sweaty and wanna take your shirt off, that'd be just fine. Hi, Skipper, hope you had a great Christmas and hopefully a better New Year. It was pretty good, I mean, I was on the boat, but uh, you know, it is what it is. I got extra pay extra pay for working Christmas and New Year. Sohu. Hello, Sohu. Sohu, you've been coming in quick. You've been coming in quick. I like that. Sohu's, so, Sohu's ready to come in. Got it on the computer. Uh, 36 Tina, what am I doing today? We had to go pick up two crane barges. So one of our boats, one of our other boats, had these two crane barges they were bringing to us. And they left Houston with them uh, two days ago. Well, they blew an engine. They blew an engine when they got over here to uh, Port, Port O'Connor and they couldn't go any further because they only had one engine. So they asked us, they had us to come pick it up. They had us come pick these two barges up from them and, can, and bring them the rest of the way. So now I got 50 miles to go. We got about 50 miles to go, 58 miles to go to get back to uh, our job. Mick and Mad, hello Mick and Mad, good afternoon. So yeah, we're doing something a little different today. 36 Tina. Da, 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 da. Captain Ron's Adventures. So we got two crane barges. 330 foot long. And we got a little boat. Y'all want to see the little boat? Y'all check this little boat out. Let me see. Oh, look at that little boat we got right there. Isn't it cute? Two crane barges and a boat. Heading back to uh, Aransas. Yeah, we only have how many people's in? Only 14 people. I trust y'all 14 people. We head back to Aransas. Almost as cute as Blanco's eyes. You're right, 36 Tina. You are correct. You know, tis the season to give compliments and 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 uh, what else? Uh, be merry. Hey, we moving. Yep, dude. We are definitely moving. We had to go pick up these two barges. The the Captain Jim broke down. They blew an engine yesterday. And uh. We had to come pick up the barges. We had to come 50, we had to come 58 miles to get these two barges and bring them back. Whoa, Captain, that came out your mouth so smooth. It was like butter, wasn't it? It came out like butter, 36 Tina. And too bad he's not in here to hear it. Oh my goodness. Happy New Year, you filthy animals. Uh-oh, who blew an engine? The boat that had these two barges, the Captain Jim. Mickey Mad, thank you for those shout outs. Bill Cop, hello Bill Cop. So we get to do a day stream today. I'll be driving my whole watch. Geek 
boy. Hello, geek boy. So much for having a chill weekend. Well, we'll be back tonight. If we don't get fogged in, we'll be back in Aransas tonight. And uh, we'll get these barges set up, and then we'll chill for the weekend. It'll only take, we should get back by uh, by 1 o'clock in the morning, between 12 and 1. As long as we don't get fogged out, because we're doing 5.4 5 miles an hour. Mango, high cap, yep, we are moving. So yeah, we're trying to get there. Trying to get there before the fog. Hi, Bill Cop. Hope everything is well and happy. How's the house going, Bill Cop? Happy New Year, always ready. How's the house going, man? Y'all getting it uh getting it situated? I'm getting this Pixel phone set up. It came early. Oh, sweet. Oh, that's not too bad. Blister and pace. Yeah, we're doing good. I thought we would push like four miles an hour. But uh, we're doing 5.4. I'm I'm ecstatic for 5.4. Believe that. I love 5.4 miles an hour. Now, when we get out into the bay, when we get into Corpus Christi Bay, uh, not Corpus Christi, uh, San Antonio. When we get to San Antonio Bay, I don't know if we're going to do 5.4, but we'll see. Cap, be careful you don't get a speeding ticket. Dookie Creek, uh, nice. You and Blanco make me want to get to it. Hey, 3016, did you fix your uh, stream, stream uh, lads? Did you fix it? Uh, gonna put up a donation goal for a new phone. Well, 3016, um, maybe. Maybe late Santa might uh, might hook you up there. Since it's after Christmas, you know, after holidays, Santa might hook you up. No, I'm boycotting this stream labs. <laughs> it's not bad to set up. I mean, I had help. I did have help to set it up. I couldn't do it on my own, but. I finally got some people to do repairs to the house. Hopefully finish soon. Yes, sir. Santa don't love me no more, Cap. But we love you, 3016. We're the Santas. We can be Santa. Look, I can even sound like it. Ready? Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas, 3016. Ho, ho, ho. Down south. Merry Christmas. Or I could do this. Merry Christmas, 36 Tina. Would you like a popsicle in your stocking? You said it better than Jimmy did. I think I did something to make Santa boycott me. Down south with all of his 14 plus years on Twitch. Oh my goodness. Howdy, Cap Robs. Texas Ag for Life. Texas Ag for Life. What's good, Bill Cop? Good to see you. Down south, gang gang, baby. So, yeah, we had to. I left. I left the Ranzas this morning at. 4.15. As soon as we dropped the barge off and, and got them secured this morning at 4.15, we left. And we had to come 58 miles to the east. And uh, we got here at uh, we got here at 12.35. So what? 8 hours and 10 minutes. 8 hours and 20 minutes it took us to get here. And uh pick up these two barges from the cabin gym and we left at uh 12 55 so we should get back there tonight at about one o'clock in the morning thought of you cap yesterday as i was eating at monument inn oh man monument inn look for a boat but you weren't near me yes i ate there i ate finally got to eat there once actually uh canna wilkes and i uh we met up with Magellan. 
we met Magellan up over there and uh, and had had a din uh, nice little dinner. It was nice. I liked it. I didn't know you was that close, Texag for life. Tazim, good afternoon. Thank you for that shout out to Tazim, Bill Cobb. Started the uh, the Starlink before I went live because we're going to be in this general direction for like uh, let me tell you how far we're going to be in this this direction probably at least eighteen uh, probably about another twenty eight miles will be in this general direction. Uh oh, am I digging up mud? Yep, I'm digging up mud. God dang it. If I had a little freaking boats of ground, I gotta get it off the mud. Shit. That little boat next to us is dragging the freaking mud. I got it off. It's off. See this little boat right here is a pain in the butt. If y'all ain't seen it yet, that boat right there is a pain in the butt. And it's off to the side. It's dragging, so if I get too close to the bank, it wants to uh, touch bottom. I just gotta pay attention to it, that's all. Let me make sure it's all good where it's at. God dang it. See, we're not used to doing that. We're not used to having a little freaking boat like that next to us. That's something we just don't do every day. So you got to account for it. And it don't help I have a boat coming at me too. Yeah, dang it, little boat. Why you do this? Great. I should have known that was dragging. We started losing speed, and I was like, yep, something's up. Because we're the one bringing it, we should have we should have put it next to us. We should have tied it off to us. But James didn't want to do that. That's okay. We'll get it. I gotta pivot my bow out into the channel. And then I can swing my stern out there, and then we're good to go. Watch this, y'all gonna see, y'all, y'all gonna see magic happen. We're gonna make magic happen. Hey, 
having to back up and then turn a bit. Yeah, I'm just gonna pivot off the boat like this and then watch. Now, turn my rudders and kick it off the bank. New Year's. 
Indians also. I'm from Mesquite. Yeah, I live down around, uh, down around, not far from like uh, uh, Lake Jackson area. shopping last night. Slim picking. Oh man, was the alert on? Hold on. Damn, sorry about that slim picking. I had it turned down. Let me play it. Let me play it for you. Hold on. It's out of stock. Tutty. Tutti. Tutti 14. Oh, let me see. I gotta catch up on chat. Oh, geek boy. Uh, nice down south. Get to move the four inches of snow we got yesterday. Happy Friday, everyone. For those who don't know, Mesquite is a Dallas suburb. Down south, jeez. Hi, Tootie. Is it Tutty? I think it's Tutty. Tutty 14, hello. We are moving, yep. Finally doing something different. I thought I forgot how to drive. Uh, in fact, uh, I almost did by putting that little boat on the mud. 3016 of who? How about them Cowboys? Hey, what was the final score last night? I didn't even see what it was. Cowboys are dead to me until Jones moves. He ain't ever moving on. <laughs> OTR payment. I don't blame you. I think I forgot how to drive too. I freaking put that little boat slap in the mud. Penguin. We get a shout out for OTR. OTR Penguin. I can't call them what I want to call them since uh, the bot gets mad. Captain Twitch is still showing me at 2.85. All right, yes, Slim. So you may have to go ahead and do another one then. Uh, you may have to go live again then. I thought it would catch up, but yeah, you may have to go ahead and just do one get you some viewers up and then and then go from there I work in Garland yeah they usually they usually keep us around the Houston area uh, 45 Park but we've been down in uh, in Nueces County working for uh, the past three months doing a pipe job there Digging some pipe out the uh, out the ship channel. My time, Captain Mary. Captain Robin, chat. Hi all. Hello, Mitchy. Come on, Captain Mary. Hotel Penguin. Hope you're well and hope everything is going well. Oh, then, yep. Yeah, I thought it would catch up, Slim. For some, you know, because you had that big average. So yeah, you do another one. Start another one. And uh, just keep it over three, and uh, it'll come. It'll come around. But you didn't lose anything. You got everything's good for thirty days, so you're good. It ain't, it didn't hurt you. What are you tugging today, Buck Thirsty? We have two crane barges strung out. Just strung out and a little boat. We have this little boat on the side right here that I just put aground a while ago, so I need to pay attention to that. But we got to bring them about another four, uh, 50, 55 miles, I think. We got to go about 55 miles with them. 
drop them off at our location where we're working. I've never seen this freaking boat move before. I know we're usually just sitting still. We can actually do some work. We're pushing these barges at five and a half miles an hour. We're 330 foot long. With the boat, if you add the boat in, we're 380 foot long. By 40 foot wide, plus that boat, that little boat. So we're probably 55 foot wide and uh, 380 foot long. Mad like wow. Oh, we move it. Man, I'd have a dang old fishing pole out, and troll some rattling rap rapalas for redfish and speckled trout. Shout out to Crammit. Uh so it'll be about 10 or 11 hour trip. Yes. I think it's gonna take us about uh yeah, about 10 hours from now. If we can keep this speed which I don't know if we will, because we're gonna buck a tide somewhere. If we're going with the tide now, you can bet we're gonna buck a tide somewhere up the road, up the canal here, we're gonna buck a tide. So we're doing five and a half, so 55 miles, we'll be there in 10 hours from now, so that's midnight, if we don't get fogged in. That's gonna be the thing. AI Bill, hi Cap, good to see you again before 2020. Yes, sir. How you doing, AI Bill? We scoop. Hi y'all, howdy sailors, stoner. Hello, stoner. Welcome back, dude. Thanks, Mickey Matt. I was here just feeding my face. Don't follow Slim Dick, because he has fish that like to lick other fishes in their no no squares. <laughs> oh, Lord. Fogged in yet? Yeah, the, the, there was some fog this morning. Uh, visibility. Uh, James said it after after I turned the wheel over to him this morning at six o'clock. He took over and he said as soon as I went downstairs, it socked in fog, and then uh, he caught it again when he crossed San Antonio Bay. That was some nice uh, wood you made for relic. Don't do it, fake news. This guy. I'm good, thanks. I thought this was your week off. I'll go all, I'll go home next week. I had to work Christmas and New Year this trip. The upside to it was I get double pay for Christmas and New Year's. We get double time, so that's not too shabby. Thanks, I think we will be on with it during the van a thon unless I miss the stream. Okay, Cap, I'm gonna start it up. Alrighty, Slim, you start it up. I'm gonna put the computer on it. I'm gonna put the computer on it over here so you have that view. They make it bank. I guess they figure if we have to sacrifice and be out here for, for the holiday, they're gonna go ahead and uh, give us a little something, something. Uh, I've got the new Pixel phone, still trying to get logged into everything. And can't make it make double pay, let's go, yep. For Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year's, they pay us uh, you know, uh, double. But I didn't work for Thanksgiving. That's the one holiday I actually had off. Next year, I'll have New Year's off. wants to boycott Streamlabs with me, them dang Streamlabs. I'm gonna give Blanco a little something, something. He might 
might appreciate that. He's always he's always bought a little something something. Learn how to 
how to fly it though, because I'd be so scared that uh, I'd crash it into the water or something. I'm gonna slow the boat down. Drone works great. Don't tugboats require a flag that indicates its origin? Uh, no, the, well, the back of our boat has a home. You gotta have the home port welded on the back of the boat with the name. You gotta have the name and the home port on the boat. But as far as the flag, uh, we don't have to, we're not required to fly an American flag. Ships do. Ships, I think, are required to fly a flag of their country. And when they come to the States, they have to, they have to fly the uh, American flag too. I think below theirs, if I have to look it up, but they have to fly their country and the American flag when they come. Malachite. Malachite, thank you for that raid, Malachite. One awesome mod of the Deadpool show. And a heck of a streamer, if I don't say so myself. Malachite. Thank you, kind sir, for that raid. Tugs mostly operate in one or two states. I've been all the way from, uh, I've been from Brownsville, Texas, all the way to Pensacola, Florida. So as far as states, I've been through, what, uh, four. Texas, Louisiana, Mississippi, at five. Texas, Louisiana, Alabama, Mississippi, Florida. That's the only five states I've been in with a tugboat. I've never been up the Mississippi River past Baton Rouge. So, yeah, never got to do that. Welcome in Raiders, Malachite. Speaking of, I do believe Deadpool's going on tonight. But if you go up the Mississippi River, there's some tugboats up there that go all the way up into, I don't know how far they go. He's on at 11 tonight, Eastern. Let's get a cigarette boat go up the Mississippi River. Yeah, I've never, in 32 years, I have never been past Baton Rouge. That's kind of hard to believe. There's a lot of uh, there's a lot of barges that go up there. I just never made the trip. Big Daddy UK, how's it going? How you doing, Big Daddy UK? Make that emote bigger no that's as big as I can make it for uh, the, the uh, I could maybe make it taller but I can't make it any wider because it's that's as wide as the uh, slot is the, for the square two-step and ahoy takeout delivery. Ahoy Captain, peanut butter beer, permission to come aboard. Absolutely two-stepping. Smoky Squirrel says, hello Bill Cop. Can we get a shout out for two-stepping? Unless, uh, in case y'all, unless y'all did already. You're going good. 
we had to come pick up these two barges. So if y'all just coming in, one of our other boats was bringing these two barges to us. And they got 58 miles away from us and they blew one of the engines. And uh, they couldn't continue. They can't push with just one engine. So they had to stop and wait for us to finish our job this morning and then come pick these up from them. So we had to, we had to leave at 4.15 this morning I left and uh, we got here at 12.30, grabbed them, and now it is 2, 2.14. So I've had them for almost two hours. We left about two hours ago with them and we gotta go 50, 50 something miles we have left to go, maybe 40, maybe 40 miles, 40, uh, maybe 48 miles to go. As the crow flies, we have, I'll tell you how far we got, 49 miles to go, yep. I'm driving today, so lurk it. Howdy, can of Wilkes. Connor Wilkes, make it mad, I go to type and it pops up. I gave up trying to beat him with shout outs. 4,900 miles, no, 49 miles to go. Did I say 4,900? Wait, we got 49 miles to go. What the hell? There's no way I can go 40 or 900 miles. Holy crap. I'd have to go back and forth a whole lot of times. Good afternoon, Skyline. Bill Cobb right. He got them exercise rip fingers. 49 miles as the crow flies. Straight. I hope I didn't do any damage to that little freaking boat, man, when I put it aground. The only thing I think I probably could have done was was maybe bent a wheel on it, but I think the hull hit. I think the hull is what touched bottom, so I think we're good. And I wasn't going fast. I was only doing five miles an hour, so. I bet it's gonna dang old sink. Sergeant Supervillain. Thank you for that biddy. The biddy of the day. You, you put the little boat around. Yeah, I got off. I got over too close to that to this side and this little boat right here. Rub bottom. That little boat I have right here next to us. It touched bottom, but uh, I got it off. I got it off the off the bank, and we we continued. It happens. That's not little. It's about a, uh, it's way smaller than us. Captain bullied the poor boat. Doing pretty well. We will see after I move all the snow again. It doesn't belong to your company. No, no, it's not ours. It belongs to these barges. The company that we're working for that has those barges over there uh, where we're working and these two, they own all that. So. I'll tell them about it when I get there. I'm gonna say, "Hey, man, look, I put that little boat aground back in the intercoastal, and I said uh, you may want to check it out, make sure it's all good. They have divers, so they can send a diver down there. They can send a diver to go look and see if there's anything that uh, if the wheel bent, but it it just drugged the bottom. It's not like it was. Uh, it's not on its own power. We're pushing it, so it should be all right." Deserves to be ran aground. I wish when they would do something like that, they have, well, no, nah, I don't know if they have the room to do it. They could put it on the deck of this barge, but I don't know if they really do have the room to do that. It would be nice if they did, but yeah, it is what it is. That's still the best lyric command.
So what's different? You shaved your beard, new year, new you. No, I didn't. I didn't shave it. Nothing yet. Still got a couple of days to decide. at noon it was kind of cloudy and overcast and hazy looking but uh about 45 minutes later bam all went away sun came out if you shave yours cap i will shave mine shave beard don't no go <laughs> i look i don't look good without a, without a beard without a goatee i don't, I don't like the way i look I was outside getting my walk in a little. Let's see what the temperature is here today. Uh, what's this closest time we're next to? There we go. Seventy-two degrees today. pretty dang good. 72 degrees is nice. Thirty sixteen is so nice out. I would shave my goatee, but I would be in trouble at home. I look like Private Powell from Full Metal Jacket, just older. Yeah, I, I, that's probably, I, I could, uh, yeah, I'd probably look like that too. Don't look good without a beard either, but here we are. <laughs> Marley's. <laughs> but yeah, here we are. <laughs> it's 30 where Dookie's at. <laughs> Dookie, yeah, Dookie says, Marley's, I prefer you without the beard. <laughs> see how many boats are in front of me coming at me two two boats and they will be out of the bay before I get there so that's all I'm looking for to make sure they are out of the bay Dookie says uh, Barney says Dookie typical you're too funny <laughs> but here we are Check that out. Let's see what this is. Oh, Marley's was jamming. Bumping booties with you, Marley's. He was doing the booty bump. I know I have a type. It's, it's like ladies without a <laughs> dookie. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, to be honest, I haven't seen Marley's with the beard, so I could not say which is better. Yes, LMAO. at least.
clip I put in your Discord. Uh, now Marley's gonna have to do the Snapchat filter with the beard just so we can see. We can, uh, yes, a Snapchat filter or, or, or a Photoshop one there. No way, let me look. So Cap, you headed back to the slip? Yep, we heading back there. These two barges are for the other job up in, uh, up in I'll, I'll tell you, it's up in Corpus. These two barges are for that other job, but they're bringing them to us for right now. I don't know why. So, uh, yeah, we heading back to the slip. We're gonna tie them up there for the weekend. I'll go home Tuesday. So, I don't know what's gonna happen after Tuesday with them. I don't know what they're gonna do, but seaworthy test. Yeah, we're fixing to cross the bay. But it's pretty calm out. It's not it's not rough today. Not much wind. So we're gonna see, uh, we're gonna cross the bay. This bay we're crossing is like, I think, how many miles wide? It is uh, eight miles wide. This bay we're fixing to cross. said when uh when he comes on watch we should be almost coming into Aransas Bay and he don't want to cross the bay if it looks like it's going to get foggy he's like if it even looks like it's going to get foggy we're going to stand by and wait till tomorrow when it's daylight and we can see and we'll go the rest of the way so we might not we might not make it there tonight it depends on if the fog sets in you know, Captain, I think Twitch hates me. I got three computers for three different people on in my house here. And then whatever you got going on, some other people, it only says three. Yeah, I have I have two on you, Slim Picking. I've got two on you myself. That's weird. Let me look. It shows three, but on yours, it has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Bro, what's up with that? I see seven people I know in there. And it's showing three. Maybe I have to comment. Let me comment. Let me put an emote. There, I just commented there. And let me put a comment here. There we go. Make it mad, just commented. Twitch hates you. Counts only one per IP, maybe. Love the new avatar. Thank you very much, Shorty Pants. I don't think Canuck Paul's been in since he's the one that made it for me. And I don't think he's been in since I put it in there. A slip is a man-made inlet for walking boats, right? Yes. Yeah, it's like they dug out a little, they dug a little, like a slip out. They dug out like a little square dock. They put bulwarks in there, nice docking bull, uh, bulwarks, and uh, and they dredged it out. And uh, that's what that's what we're working out of. Howdy, shorty pants. Loving the new avatar. I need to go to town and find a case for this phone. It's freaking me out with no case and all the glass. It's slick. Yes, I know. What you, I know what you mean. Counts only one per IP, maybe. Slim all depends if they are signed in and if they are in different accounts. Shows 48 here. Flim Flam. Howdy, Flim Flam. I 
also Grio Slims as well, but they're not on his channel. Yeah, my mom is one hot mama. My son is in there. Slim is misspelled or whatever the hell he's got. And then Jack Jackson is in there. It's like the girls slip a place for guys. <laughs> Damn. do hosting anymore either. I used to love hosting. I ain't gonna lie. I like hosting. Hosting was great. It is. Am I wrong, Captain? You are not wrong. That is that is a uh, that is a true statement. Hosting was great. Yep, I love the host. But yep, took it away. Now you're showing four. Now you're showing five, six, Slim. It's starting to come around. It's starting to come around, Slim. I'm showing you guys six. Because you knew who was online and connecting was easier. I'm booting up a PC for you, Slim. Thing. I'll take that blame. Shorty pants, I got you on that one. We have some here still. We have some habanero. Is it habanero I got? I got three different cons. Let me show you which one. Let me see. We got. I have red hot. I have max red hot one. I've got uh, hot and spicy from HEB. Habanero. Habanero chicharron. But the problem is, is I got a, 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 a tooth that's hurt. I got a bad tooth, an infection, I think. So I can't chew on one side of my mouth. So that's why I didn't, that's why I didn't go live last night. Uh, this morning, when I worked this morning, I was gonna go live. Oh my God, my freaking tooth hurts so bad. It's better now. It's better, but it's still a little. It just, it's just a little something in my gums. Mine's just picante. What's good, TBDH? Happy early New Year's. Same to you. So, Cap, want to make this uh, on stream challenge, and we can keep the goatees if you're scared. Save off the beard live. <laughs> I have to think about that. We wake up the peacocks conversing every morning. Hi, you're not yet. Sorry to hear about you. About yeah, it's weird. Suzanne, hello, Suzanne. Yeah, it's like the, I can move the tooth a little bit. This happened to me about, uh, it happened about three months ago and within a week it was fine. So I don't know if something got in the gum or whatever when I was eating or I don't know, but it happened a while back and within a week it was better. So it's better already. It's like right now I don't feel it, but I don't chew on that side either. It's my back tooth. The bottom tooth all the way to the back on my right side. Uh, hi TBDH, Dookie, uh, I could never do it. I hate going to the dentist. I know, I don't know if I wanna go. I'm normally awake before them. I get problems with my gums sometimes. Stupid autocorrect. Flim Flam, my neighbor had some that sounded like girls screaming. That's what they sound like? I, I, don't, know, I don't think I've ever heard a peacock. 
Hello, Robin Crone. Robin Crone. So are y'all ready? Are y'all ready for the Relic Vanathon today? Four o'clock, y'all. I know Robin Crone's ready. Thought ship captains pulled teeth. I tell you what, last night if I could have pulled it, I told that to Ken and Wilkes. I'm like, I feel like I would just want to pull this thing out, but I'm scared to do it. But if I could have, I blame Keto. Hey, Marlins, are you resting from your walk? Uh, where's we going fishing today? Nunya, what's going on, Nunya? We're bringing these two barges back to our uh, our pike location. We'll probably be there if we can continue running and not stop for, for fog. If we get shut in fog and can't see, we'll have to stop. But as long as we can see, we should be there by one in the morning. Yeah, pretty much. Freaked the shit out of me first morning here. Two-step, but has no teeth to cause pain anymore. 67 Chevy. Oh, why throw pie because it, of the three stooges? Why throw pie is because of the three stooges? I was so tired all day. I was like, what the F? Heck yeah, oh boy, I'm, yes I'm ready, but I can't stay up all night. My brother and his bed. I'm looking forward to seeing him open the crate. I know I want to see that too. He didn't open them yet, did he? He's going to open them on stream? You'll send picking. You get pie as well. You should get some clove oil. That will help. Clove oil. Same here had FTD, FTC like five years ago. Pecan pie. Might need, might need a little bit of Blanco butter to fill in your teeth. Oh, Lord. I'd rather get kicked in the head than have a toothache. Yes, clove is great, tastes horrible. Oh, they want me to hit the horn. <laughs> they wanted me to hit the horn, so I hit the, I hit the horn. What's your visibility limits? Half mile? If we can see from a, uh, oh, let me wave with these people going. They were waving, so they had some kids on the boat. I had to blow the horn for them. I gotta blow the horn for the children. What's your visibility? I think if we can do, uh, if we can see one set of markers, one set of buoys, but the thing is, once it starts setting in, you don't know when it's gonna sock in where you can't see anything. I use strong mouthwash to kill the bacteria. That's what a can of Wilk said. I should have one of them guys from the dock bring me some Listerine. Like the, isn't that the strongest, Listerine? I'd rather get kicked in the head. Uh, I get in trouble, so I'm picking. I buy stuff without asking on Google Play. Need a faster boat or a shorter waterway. Clove oil can help with tooth pain too, or both. About 700 to about 700 last month, 800. Probably five miles or so. In emergency, I pour a bit of peroxide. That's what I did. They gave me peroxide. Lord Google, I didn't have any on the boat, so. Uh, I asked I asked uh, Donnie if we had peroxide on the boat or the radio last night or this morning. I said, man, do we have any peroxide on the boat? And he's like, no, I don't think so. And the barge hurt. And they said, hey, we got some cap. Because uh, I, I told Donnie what I needed it for. And they said, we got some. So they gave me some peroxide. But it's in a spray bottle. So I had to spray it in my mouth. I had to spray peroxide in my mouth, swish it around, and then spit it out. Oh, it was it was nasty. I don't know if he's opened them yet, or uh, hope he opens them on stream. Uh, 
67 Chevy T-Mobile. Clover is what they used to sedate the two in the old days, right? Blanco. Oh, hello, Blanco. Blanco's in the chat. Did somebody say they wanted Blanco butter? Because I'm here and I got a one pound jar. And I know what that B word stands for. I know. It was no fishing planet mobile. Uh, it was no fishing planet mobile. Hey, hey, hope all is well. I thought it was opium. I want you to honk your horn. Howdy, Blanco. How are you, my friend? Hi, buddy. How are you doing? Uh, yeah, games will get you. Sorry, everyone, on it having a hard time keeping up. Ambasol. Ambasol. Yep, yep. Uh oh. I gotta make sure I don't go around again. Freaking boat, man. This little boat on the barge is a pain in my butt. Maybe vodka would help. Well, I'm fresh out. Fresh out the vodka. Money hungry games, slim picking, hard not to buy, hard not to not buy. Okay, I think we're clear. Hello, Captain Rob. Hello, Van Girl. I'm trying to keep up with the chat, uh, with the chat and drive at the same time. Lord Google. Also, I buy a chunk of raw garlic. Oh, that helps too. Peroxide mixed with a bit of water can help as well, but more for the gums. Or what about doing warm salt water? Swishing it around. Hey Blanco, did you hear Captain's getting the mini cap to keep mini Blanco company? Captain Rob, I got something that will get rid of that pain in your mouth. No, you don't. Nope. Nope. 36 Tina helped me stay out of trouble. Blanco, you sent it to me? Shame, shame. Have you found your case yet, my friend? Uh, how is Naked working out? Yeah, Blanco, how's Naked working out for you? Amp Mods, hello Amp Mods. I'm so, I'm behind on chat. No, I'm getting ready to move snow, so maybe later. I'm actually getting over being sick, so I'm fully dressed right now. Cracker Barrel was packed like a can of tuna fish. Uh, Blanco, I'm so happy you are getting better. Captain Rob, slow down, I'm getting a nosebleed. We're doing 5.2. stomach bug. Uh, Blanco, feel better, Cat Rob, if you just start sucking on the necklace that I gave you. That will cure the toothache, I promise. Just think of it as a... No! I am not. No. Nope. Not gonna happen. Hi, Cap Rob. How are you today? Wizards Knights. Hello, Mission. We got to bring these two crane barges back to our location. The boat that had them broke down. They uh, blew an engine yesterday, so they couldn't go any further. So we had to come pick them up. They were only 58 miles away from us. Hello, hello, Temple of God. You're gonna need a bigger boat. Sorry, pants. Hello, how you making mad, Marley's? You had a wonderful stream the other day. Hope you're doing well. Blanco, a pearl necklace. 
temple of God says, hey, make it mad, two-stepping. I mean, if you... I mean, if you want one and the cap doesn't mind, I guess I can. Hello, sir. Permission to come aboard. Chakanat. Hello, Chakanat. Grad Admiral of the Inshore Lifeboat. Got to jump ship. Have a safe trip. All right, Nunya. Thank you for coming in. Good seeing you. Cap Rob needs another pro necklace. I, I'm, I'm good on necklaces. I appreciate it, but uh, I think I'm full up on necklaces. We're good. <laughs> Cap, if you toss out any crab pots over Christmas or fish, did I? No. I don't know if we still have that crab trap on here. Uh, Donnie been trying to fish. Donnie was fishing every day out there and uh, he wasn't getting much luck. My mom went to the hospital on Christmas Day with COVID. Oh, is she doing okay, Robin? Christmas Day, dang, that wasn't even a week. Hi, all crewmates. Wait now, LOL, Blanco, we should have put that pendant on a pearl necklace. No, it's nice weather, gotta be thankful for that. It's, it's pretty today. It is nice. I got the air conditioner on up here. It's, it's pretty warm. something different but don't let him pass you oh he's catching me he's definitely catching me I'm doing 5.2 he is going 7.5 she's getting better but the steroids are making her blood sugar go up so she's still in the hospital Welcome. How are you doing, lovely? 3016. Yeah, he's doing five. He's doing seven and a half. 7.8 now. So he he's going to catch me. Nothing I can do about it. Cap, you're going to have the other one pass on the two. So a little bit of drag. Yeah, well, now I'm going to have him come by me on my port side. Yeah, I'm just gonna have it come by on the port side. On it'll be on the two. It'll be the two for his two. Yes. Have you been watching people crossing over in El Paso on Twitch? I haven't seen that. No, I haven't. I know First Responder Media was out a while back. Uh, showing some of that. Time to kick the NOS and turbo. Stupid question. Is 5.5 fast? For us, yes. This is a good speed. Anything over five miles an hour is good for this for this load. Because we have two barges strung out. We're 380 foot long by 50 foot wide. So uh, or 55 foot wide. So yeah, we're doing a we're doing pretty good. That's a good speed. I'll take five. Today's a good day. Can't complain for asking Mr. Peanut Butter. Tell him you got a dagger so you need a bit more space. A dragger. Tell him you got a dragger so you need a bit more space. He's only got one barge. He's got a pressure barge. So uh, 